The Bellevue Utilities Department is responsible for evaluating the health of the streams in Bellevue. And so one of the things that we do is to check the diversity of the fish population that's living in our streams. By looking at the diversity, then we can have a better feel for how well the stream is doing and whether there's any major problems. Today we're sampling in the main stem of Kelsey Creek, which flows from Larson Lake to Mercer Slough. We're currently sampling in Glendale Country Club on a project site, and then we'll also be doing a site that is a trend assessment to find out how things change over time. Cutthroat trout, fork length, 79. It's important to find out how Kelsey Creek is doing because it's our major salmon stream in Bellevue. This is where the majority of our salmon come in and spawn. So we have Chinook salmon, which are on the endangered species list. We have sockeye, coho. We also have cutthroat trout. And so it's a very important spawning area, which is unique in an urban environment. Cutthroat trout, 92. Cutthroat trout, 54. At this point, we're about halfway through the reach. So far, we have cutthroat trout, and it looks like we've got about three different age classes, which means that the system has enough diversity to handle a variety of sizes of fish, which is a good thing. So we have um, native dace and also lamprey and cutthroat trout. So overall, we have a good diversity of sizes. We have native fish. We haven't come across any non-native fish yet, which is good. And uh, the one thing that we're missing still is the coho, and so we're still looking for the juvenile coho, which we have high hopes in the pool area upstream. What's really exciting about Kelsey Creek is that Kelsey Creek has maintained its diversity since the 80s. And so in an urban environment, it's really incredible to have maintained the natural fish that we've always had. And so our charge is to manage the system so that we maintain that diversity and the complexity in the stream.